I've got a bosom wonders. I've tasted of your power. Only share I knew. You have shown me so much mercy, much more than I deserve. Only share. God's glory manifestation of glory if someone came to this world and he did not manifest glory that means that person is a minus to the world manifestation of glory and I told us that the scripture is Psalm 19, Psalm 19 verse 1 Psalm 19 verse 1 it says the heavens declares the glory of God and the firmament show his handiwork. The God we are serving, though we can't see him physically, is invisible. But everything in creation is what? Is showing his handiwork. And you are part of his creation. And as part of his creation, God has deposited a measure of glory 
inside you. And that glory will manifest in the name of Jesus. Amen. And I pray for you will not be a minus Amen. to this world Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. You are going to make impact in, the, in life. Amen. You will add to the blessing of this generation Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. So I told us that glory is the full weight, full essence, to, true nature of a thing. So, and there is glory hidden inside every one of us. We are, we are not empty. You are a moving container, a walking container, full of glory, full of God's glory. And I pray for you, all the glory of God that is buried within you will come out alive in the name of Jesus. Amen. Many, many people have said they have filled their glory in the symmetry of life. They did not manifest their full potential before they leave this world. And that is why it's a tragedy to them and minus to this world. But that will not be your own portion in the Amen. name of Jesus. Say, I will not take my glory to the grave. I will not take my glory to the grave. I will Amen. manifest my full glory. I will manifest my new my my children glory. will not take their glory to the grave. My children will not take their glory to the they grave. They will manifest their full glory. They will manifest their full glory. Say in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I refuse. To take my glory to the to grave. My glory to the in grave. the name of Jesus. In the name of I, will Jesus. I will manifest my full glory. That is a full glory. That is a partial glory. That is a thin glory. That is a robust glory. But what will you manifest is your full glory in the name of Jesus. Amen. Many people walk around the world with their masterpiece in their mind. Buried under a wishful thinking. Many people that have glory inside them, they have something to do, but they are just walking about. They are having, ah, if I would do this, they have a wishful thinking. They are thinking of doing something and they end up not doing it. Any power that wants you to be, to be having a wish and you are unable to fulfill that wish, today let the power be destroyed. Amen! Not just, not just being wishing alone. Somebody said, if wish is a us, everybody will hide. But you must do that which you wish to do. Receive power to do it in the Amen. name of Jesus. Many people, what makes them not to manifest their glory is procrastination. Procrastination. What they're supposed to do today, they will procrastinate. I will do it tomorrow. That is a thief of time. That is a thief of glory. I pray every spirit of procrastination, let it live your life now. Amen. Another, another thing that makes people not to manifest their glory is fear when they are afraid. Another one is intimidation. Listen to me. Don't allow anybody to intimidate you with their glory. Don't allow anybody to make you look inferior. Many people, they can't express themselves because of intimidation. I pray every bone of intimidation in your life, let it be broken in the name of Jesus. Amen. So you must break yourself loose from all this power. Break yourself loose from every power that don't want you to manifest your full glory. You are going to stand up wherever you are. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I break myself loose. I break myself from loose every power from every power that don't want me to, 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 to manifest my glory. Don't want me to manifest Say my every, glory. Power every power that want to make me, that want to make me a living corpse. A living corpse. I break you. I break in you. the name of Jesus. Name of Say you Jesus. power procrastination. You power procrastination. Break, break over my life. Break over my life. Power of fear. Power Break over my life. Power of intimidation. Break over my life. Power of excuses. Break over my life. Say from today, I release myself from every power that want to make me a living cause. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say that I love the way we pray. You know, some people they are just a living corpse. They are dead. But they are still walking. That will not be your portion. Amen. So Amen. glory is the true essence of a thing. And it's self-manifestation. Self-manifestation. There was a guy called Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan. A great footballer, a, a basketball player. He was once intimidated by his school, his school coach. And that coach told him, you can never be a basketballer professional. You can't play. You can never be a basketballer professional. He was intimidated. He looks down on him and says, you, you can't amount to anything. But this guy, Michael Jordan, broke the barrier. Somebody, you are every barrier 
meeting you. You will break in the name of Amen. Jesus. He believes in the dream he carried. You have to believe in what you carry. Even when others did not believe in you. He lived the dream he carried and work at developing and perfecting his faith. And perfecting himself. He was developing us himself. Somebody you need to develop what you carry. Even when people are saying that you are nothing, tell yourself, I'm somebody. Somebody, say, I'm somebody. I'm somebody. Believe in yourself when, those, when people do not believe in you. Believe in your dream when people do not even know the dream. Believe in your dream. So this guy, he began to work upon himself, he developed himself, and he perfect his fame. Today, he stands as an athletic icon for millions, for millions. To see him in the court displaying, playing, that is his true glory. Michael Jordan, Michael Jordan glory is in what? In basketball. Playing, when you see him, this call the gift of God is his athletic ability. That is the gift that God has given to him. So, you too, you may have another, you may have the whole Eden glory, like music, art, writing. That is another glory that you carry that you don't know. Maybe baking, acting, designing. Comedy, comedy today now is is giving people money, isn't it? Yes, sir. People are making money through comedy. It's a glory. Somebody discovered that this thing is in me, and it can fetch me money. And they are, people are, are here about them. So your own glory must be any ability that God has given to you. Maybe footballing, teaching, leadership. So whatever is your gift, whatever is your talent. That is your glory. And I pray for you. It will bring you to light. Amen. It will bring you to blessing. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. So God has given you those things. For you to fill the earth with it. God the creator. Is, a, is the God of glory. Who created everything to expose his own glory. And glory is full of manifestation. Of your purpose. Which is your true self. Your true self. Many of us, we are not manifesting our true self. You are manifesting another people's glory, a counterfeit glory. From today, any counterfeit manifestation in your life, let the Lord remove it in the name of Amen. Jesus. Let somebody say, I will not live a life of counterfeit. I will not live a life of counterfeit. In the name of Jesus. In the name of say, Jesus. Say, I will live my will true self. I will live my true self. I will live my true self. I will, live my true I will be original. I will be original. Not photocopy. No photocopy. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. However, when we see a fish, fish needs something to survive. What is it? Water. Water. It displays its glory. We are in the water. Also, a seed, a seed needs what soil to bring forth its full glory. You can't just drop a seed on a rock; it won't manifest. So there is an environment, a condition of your glory. If you are going to manifest full glory, you need the right environment to manifest your true nature. Somebody today, the environment that you have limiting your manifestation let the lord relocate you Amen. in the name of jesus Amen. there is an environment that you need to get to where your true nation your full glory will be you know manifesting god will take you there in the name of jesus Amen. so glory is released when the condition are right and demand are made on it so as the destruction of a seed is the death of a tree so the suspension the suppression and retardation of human potential is the destruction of glory. When your glory is being suspended, depressed, if you are not in the rightful environment, then your glory is being suppressed, your glory is being suspended, retarded. So, when we destroy a tree or a seed, we have destroyed its fruits. So, when a glory is not, is not being allowed to grow in an environment, then we have destroyed that glory. Today, any environment destroying your potential, I pray again, let the Lord take you out of the place in the name Amen. of Jesus. Can you please rise up now and roar to heaven? Say, Oh Lord, my Father, oh Lord, my Father put, me in the right environment, put me in the right environment, in the right environment, in the right environment to, manifest to manifest my true nature in the name of Jesus.
Jesus. Somebody need to pray. Pray for your children. Take me to the right environment. Put me in the right environment to manifest my true nation. I need the right environment. The right platform. In the name of Jesus. Alebosha. In the name of Jesus. Give, put my ministry to the right environment. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Say there is a place until you get there, you will manifest your full glory. Because where you are right now is limiting you, is retarding you. I pray as you rule a thundry, amen. Today, let the Lord take you out of that environment. Amen. Say, oh Lord, my Father, oh Lord, my father. don't allow my potential. Oh Lord, my potential. To be, suppressed, to be suppressed, to be retarded, to be suspended. Say my potential, my gift will not be retarded, will not be suppressed. In the name of Jesus, will not be suspended. My glory will not be suppressed, will not be retarded. In the name of Jesus, say good amen. We pray that it's a power. Suspending, suspending, suppressing, suppressing and returning my, my glory in the name of Jesus. Name Release of me. Jesus. Let me go in the name of Jesus. Every power that is suppressing my glory, that is returning my glory, returning the glory of my ministry in the name of Jesus. Release me. Let me go. Release me. Let me go. Release me. Let me go. Release me. Let me. Aha. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say your hands towards me right now. Every power that is suppressing, depressing, and retarding your glory today, I command. Let the power release you now. Amen. Any power from your foundation that says you won't manifest, let the power release you by fire. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. When Pharaoh said he won't allow the people of Israel to go, God said, Allow them to go. He said, I won't allow them to go. God had forced him. With ten plague and allow them to go. Whatever is going to cause God to release you from that power, so that you can go and manifest your full glory today. Let it begin to happen in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, blessed Redeemer. Thank you, Daddy Jesus Lord. name we pray. Amen. 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 In Jesus name. Says. Let somebody shout. I will manifest my glory. I will manifest my glory. Amen. Amen. So every invention. Is the manifestation of someone's glory. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. Every invention that we see today is the manifestation of someone's glory. The telephone that we are using today is the glory of Alexander Graham Bell, the man that discovered that we can we can be talking to ourselves without seeing ourselves. It's like glory of someone. It displays the television, the cars, the computers, the cookers. The buildings that we are seeing, all these things are the manifestation of someone's glory. Where is the manifestation of your own glory? Ask yourself. If these people did not give us what we are seeing today, maybe today we will have been in darkness. Someone, you are hearing me, there is a glory, a great invention, work of heart, a product, a business idea that lies on top within you. Let it manifest. Amen. Let it burst out. Amen. Say my glory. Amen. Burst out. Amen. Manifest. Amen. The glory, the love of my children. Of my children. Burst, burst out. out. Manifest. Manifest. Burst out. Burst out. Manifest. 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 In the name of Jesus. I will not take this glory to the cement tree. In the name of Jesus. Can somebody pray like this? Say, every on top glory within me manifest by fire. On top glory within my children manifest by fire. Manifest by fire. My on top glory manifest. 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 In Jesus name we pray. Aha. That invention idea in you in the name of Jesus we burst out by fire Amen. in the name of Jesus Amen. so sit down the concept of glory is practical and relevant not only to God but to his creation God is a God of glory and he has given every one of us all, all his entire creation 
their personal glory. You have your own personal glory. My glory is different from your own. He's the giver of glory. You are created to glorify your God through the productivity of the works of your hand. Glory is the manifestation of one true nature. One's work. That's what we call glory. Your, your own work. You say, I'm the one that do this. I produce this. You will be happy that you create something. God is a creator. You too, you are a creator. You are his image. You must bring out something. Stop consuming what other people are creating. You to create your own. Say, I will create my own. I will create my own. Many people, they are rejoicing. They are not, you are a creator. You are his image. What the clothes you are putting on, somebody created it. And you enjoy it, isn't it? Yes, sir. So what have you created for people to enjoy? That is the question. And there is something you need to create. It will burst out. Amen. Amen. So when we use our gifts, when we use our talents to realize our vision and our dream, we are giving our creator. We are manifesting the glory that our creators has put inside us and we make him to be happy. Therefore, when we say we are glorifying God, when you say your life is glorifying God, does not mean that we are in church praising God though. Because that is the idea some people have. But rather, we are putting our hands to what? To productivities. That is when you are glorifying God. You don't give glorify God if you are not doing anything. So you must put your hand to something. One of the fundamental meaning of the word worship, when we say we, are wash, we worship, is to work. Worship means work. So we must realize that there is a given work we have been assigned by our creator in order to fulfill his praise. There is a given work that God has given to you for you to show for his praise. If you don't do that work, you are not worshiping him. You are not praising him. So your life must be a life that glorifies God by the production of the work of your hand. Today, I pray for you, your life will glorify God. Amen. In the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. So you owe it to yourself and your creator. The Bible says in Matthew, Matthew chapter 5 verse 16, Matthew chapter 5 verse 16 says, Let your light shine before men that, you, that they may see your good works and do what and glorify your father which is in heaven your light let it manifest let people see it let them see your good work so when your life manifests before people and they see your good what will they do they will glorify god but if you are a living being and people are not seeing your work nothing in you glorify nothing in you is blessing them will they glorify god so they must see you and say, Lord, we thank you for somebody. Ah, we thank you for Pastor John Debo. They, may, they, they must see you and begin to thank God and glorify God because of you. Why? Because your life is a blessing. Somebody you are going to say, Father, Father let the words of my hand glorify you. you. In the name of in Jesus. Name of Lord, through Lord, the words of, words of my hand, let your name be glorified. In the name of Jesus. Let the words of my hand glorify you. In the name of Jesus. Say a good amen. Amen. When you look at the life of your children, you prophesy into their lives. Say, my children, the you work of your hand will glorify God. Your gift will glorify God. Your talent will glorify God. I prophesy to everyone that the sound of God through me. The work of your hand will glorify God in the name of amen. Jesus. Amen. So it is a terrible thing to pass through this world without a proof of your existence. People must see the infallible proof of your existence now and after you have gone. They must know that somebody appeared. Hey, hey. Somebody came to this world. Somebody appeared in the, in, 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 on head. And people will say, Ah, we thank God. I pray for you. People will know that you came to this world. Amen. First Corinthians chapter 15, verse 41. First Corinthians chapter 15, verse 1 says, There is one glory of the sun another glory of the moon another glory of the stars for one star differ from another star in glory hey, hey. this time i found that everything and everybody in creation have an ordained glory isn't it yes, sir. and this glory differs from one another 
I can't be terrified with your glory. My own glory differs from you. You carry glory. I carry glory. Yes. I can't be envious of your glory. But it's a tragedy for me and for the world if I didn't manifest my own glory. Say, oh Lord, my Father. Oh Lord, my Father. I have a different glory. I have a different glory. Personal to me. Personal to me. That I must manifest. That I must manifest. You have created me. You have created me. With a peculiar glory. A peculiar glory. Let this glory Let manifest. This glory let the glory manifest. Let this glory manifest. I have a personal glory. In the name of Jesus, this glory manifests. In Jesus, let me pray. Amen. I want you to pray very well and pray this prayer. Hey, parents, please pray this prayer for your children. Say, Father, Father, give me power, give me power to manifest, to manifest my, ordained my ordained glory here on earth. Here on earth. I, shall die. I shall not die and, die. and, and, live, a I and live, live a wasted life. I will not live a wasted life. Power to manifest my ordained glory. Fall on me, the name of Jesus. Fall on me. Power to manifest my ordained glory. Oh, yeah, command it. Fall, fall. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Hey, glory reside in you. Hey, the glory of God in you. Let it burst out in the name of Jesus. Sit down. Paul was telling the people of Romans in chapter 8, verse 19. Romans 8 19. For the earnest expectation of the creature waited for the manifestation of the sons of God. When we look at Jesus Christ, the coming of Jesus Christ, the Son of God, was for a purpose. You too, your coming to this world was for a purpose. You are not a mistake. Let somebody say, I'm not a mistake. I'm not a mistake. The purpose of Jesus Christ was to die. Not to just come to this world without a business or specific assignment. He even said it. My business, my work is to do the work the Father has and to finish it. And he said, for this purpose I have come. You must know the purpose why you came to this world. And the purpose for you to reveal the glory that God has put inside you. You will reveal it in the name of Amen. Jesus. So there is a solution, a correction and an answer that nobody can give except Jesus. Likewise, there is a solution. There is a solution that nobody can ever give. There is an answer that nobody can ever give except you. You will give that solution. Amen. You are a solution provider. Amen. You will answer people's questions. In the name of Jesus. Amen. So when Jesus Christ was born, all that he needed to fulfill this assignment has been programmed inside him. What made him different and unique from other men that came before him or that were living during his own time was the glory or his assignment which he came with. What will make you to be different from other people is what you carry. And that thing will manifest. Amen. So everyone born to this world has been given an assignment and a solution that only him can provide. And that is your glory. That is an assignment. That is a solution that only you can provide. That is your glory. May it manifest in the name of Jesus. Amen. So, your glory is your uniqueness. Your glory is your identification. Your glory is your peculiarity. Your glory is your trademark. Your logo. When you say, this is my logo, you are talking about your glory, your own trademark. Your tra if, you, if you see trademark of every business, is different from one another. Logo's different. That is your logo. May your logo appear in the name of Jesus. Amen. So what makes you different from other men like you is your glory. Scientifically, it has been proved that no two people are alike. Isn't it? Even the identical twins that we call the identical twins, they are not alike. They are fingerprints. They are high boss. Every other thing are not the same. So God made it so, so that everyone can complement each other. Man is not made to be independent or sufficient in themselves. God created us 
to be not to be self-sufficient. It's only God that is self-sufficient. And that is why you must do something to contribute. Because anyone that falls, that fails to manifest God's glory, or the glory that God has given inside them, is a minus to creation. And many destinies that are connected to the manifestation will suffer. Listen to you. There is, to me, there is a destiny connected to my manifestation. There is a destiny connected to your own manifestation. If you fail to manifest, those destiny will suffer. Are you listening to me? Yes, sir. What God has given to you, you are, it's not meant for you alone. Oh, yes. So, because God created us to be to be interdependent. We are not self-dependent. We are not self-sufficient in ourselves. So, if God did not, if you fail to bring out what God has put inside you, other, other destinies, other people that are supposed to come out, that are supposed to rise up through you, they will suffer. Why? Before you, because you failed. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I will not fail. I will not fail. In the name of Jesus. Say all that destiny. All that destiny. Attached to my manifestation. Attached to my manifestation. Will not suffer because of me. Will not suffer because of me. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. If Jesus failed to manifest his full glory, the whole world would have been doomed. But because he came, he died. When he was about dying, he has the, he has the ability to say, no, I won't do it again. But he surrendered. He did not fail. He gave himself to the world. And that is why we have salvation today. You too, you must, you will not fail. Amen. Whatever is going to take you to manifest your glory, receive it now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Receive the Bible now record in John chapter 2 verse 11 that Jesus Christ did something that no man has ever done in John 2 11. He turned water to wine and it was said to be a miracle. The part of that miracle is his manifestation. There is, some, there is something that nobody has ever done that God is expecting you to do. That is your manifestation. Some people are saying that there is no new thing under heaven. Ah, there are a lot of new things under heaven. Have we heard about something called COVID-19 before? Where did it come from? There is another new thing in the bad aspect. But there are a lot of good Glorious thing. So let me tell you, new new things are coming in right now. Some people have seen it, some people have not yet seen it. Some people are batting new things now. Listen to me. When we are going to see in another five, ten years' time, the new things that this world is going to experience will shock you. Some people now they have been displaying new things. Why you are still still there, nothing to display. I pray what you need to display for the world to see. Let it begin to manifest in the name of Jesus. Amen. The beginning of miracle Jesus did in Cana of Galilee and manifested forth his glory, and his disciples believed in him. In other words, they did not believe in him until he manifested his glory. What will make people to believe in you? Lord, we take you manifest in your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. So you are born with an embodiment of miracle. There is something unique inside you. And when you are delivered, when you bring it out, then you started manifesting your glory. The essence of this feast is for you to be able to give back to that miracle inside you. There is a power that is coming upon you to activate the glory inside you in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. For the, earnest, for the earnest expectation of the creation waited for the manifestation of the sons of God. The world is waiting for you. Amen. Because they know that you are a solution provider. Amen. They know you are going to give answer. Oh, yes. The answer to the problem of this world lies within you. Within you. The world is in darkness. The world is in confusion. And we are going to shine as light to the darkness of this world Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. The manifestation of the sons of God made the world a better place. If you don't manifest our glory, this world will not be a better place. But we will manifest in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Amen. manifestation of the sons of God brings down heaven on earth. The world had no knowledge of electricity. As I've told us before, before the birth of Michael Faraday, but this child of God changed the face of the world 
with the experiment which he carried out in 1831. Today, he gave us what we call it electricity. That was his glory. If he didn't give us, maybe till today, the world would have been in darkness. He came and he delivered what God has given to him. What God has put inside him. He gave birth to his miracle and manifested his glory. Say, oh Lord, my father. Oh Lord, my father. Let, me Let me give back to my own miracle. Let me give back to my own miracle. Let me give back to my own miracle. Let me, Let me own manifest miracle. my glory. There is a miracle inside me that I must deliver to this world. Oh Lord, empower me to give back to my miracle. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Lord, empower me to give back to my miracle. In the name of Jesus. Empower me to give back to my miracle. Empower my children to give back to their miracle. In Jesus, then we pray. Amen. What we call miracle is what people have not seen. Eyes have not seen. Ears have not heard. He has not entered into the heart of man. That which God has prepared for them. When you give your life to Jesus Christ and you accept him as your Lord and personal savior, then you are born into the family of God. I want to say to you, if you are hearing me, you have not given your life to Jesus Christ. What I'm talking about glory you can understand it. It is when you give your life to Jesus, then you are born into his family, then you are carrier of God's glory, and you will manifest your hidden glory. I want to invite you to give your life to Jesus. <laughs> Listen to me. Yes, this world has an expiry date. One day, this world is going to be folded. So, your manifestation of glory is not just in this world alone. We are still going to manifest his glory. Even we are going to be like him. We will behold him face to face. So if you are listening to me, you are not yet giving your life to Jesus. I'm inviting you, give your life today. So that you can manifest your glory here on earth and you reign with him in glory in heaven in the mighty name of Amen. Jesus. So if you are here hearing me, you can send yes to our email number. Contact us and we are going to bless you with the word of God and your life will never remain the same in the name of Jesus. Amen. I want you to take this prayer with me. Say, oh Lord, my Father, oh Lord, my Father I give my life to you, give my life to you as, a Lord, as my personal Lord and Savior. Lord, 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 forgive me all my sins. Me all my sins. Wash, me Wash me away all my sins. All my sins. Make, me a new creation. Make me a new creation. Today, Today as I receive you, as I receive you release, a release a new glory over my life, over my life. In, the in the name of Jesus. Say good Amen. amen. As you have prayed that prayer, you have, been, you have become a child of God. Amen. You are now a carrier of a new glory. Amen. Power not to go to the world. Receive it in the name Amen. of Jesus. Thank you, everlasting Father. Thank you, Daddy. You are going to pray. Say, Oh Lord, my Father. Oh Lord, my Father. It is time for me, is time for to, me. Manifest to manifest my own glory. In the name of Jesus. Name Say, Oh Lord, my Father. Oh Lord, my Father. Help me. Help Help me. Empower me. Empower me. Empower me. Empower me. Empower me. Empower me. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, power that want to corrupt my ordained glory. Power that want to corrupt my ordained glory. Do you understand that? Some people, there that, that, that has power that corrupt their glory. And their glory now, it was not how it, it's supposed to be. Say power that wants to corrupt my glory. You are a liar. In the name of Jesus. Be destroyed. 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 In the name of Jesus. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. My glory. The glory of my wife and children will not be corrupted. Say my glory will not be corrupted. Say oh Lord. Deliver my glory. Glory. From, corruption. from corruption in Jesus name we pray Amen. say grace of God, grace of God to manifest glory to manifest fall glory. upon me in the name of Jesus say Jesus. mercy of God, mercy of God to, manifest to manifest glory flow into my life say help of God to manifest glory come upon my life say favor of God to manifest glory flow into my life in the name of Jesus say divine arrangement 
for me to manifest glory. For me to manifest glory. Manifest in the name of Jesus. Say divine connection. For me to manifest glory. Begin to take place now. In the name of Jesus. Say divine validation. That will make me to manifest glory. Begin to take place now. Say divine greatness of God. For me to manifest glory. Manifest now. In the name of Jesus. I want you to stretch your hands towards me. Your prayer request, if it's with you, bring it out. Your water, your oil, your mantle, bring it out. Anything you want to your, your family photograph, bring it out wherever you are. If you are hearing me and you are not, you are not with all those things, just lay your hands upon your upon yourself, upon your head, wherever you are. I pray for you. Any power against your glory, let them be destroyed by fire that they be done. Any disturbing yoke attacking you, attacking your glory, let them scatter by fire. Amen. Any challenging yoke in your life, in your foundation, let it scatter by fire. Amen. Anything manipulating your life, manipulating your glory, in the name of your scatter by fire. Amen. Any power opposing you, anytime you want to manifest, let the power be destroyed in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. Any contrary voice that you are hearing, contrary voice saying you can't manifest, contrary voice saying you can't make it, contrary voice saying saying that you can't you can't be somebody in life. I silence them. Amen. I silence them. Amen. I silence them. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. If there is any gang up anywhere, any gang up anywhere, any battle anywhere, any conspiracy anywhere against your manifestation, let the Lord scatter them. Amen. Let the Lord scatter them. Amen. Let the Lord scatter them. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray on your prayer request. <laughs> The Bible says, Hear me, O God, when I call. O God, that answered prayers unto you, all flesh will come. I pray that request you have written, that request in your heart, let the Lord answer you by fire. Amen. The oil inside, in your, inside that bottle, the oil you are carrying, I turn it to the power of God. Amen. The anointing for you to manifest, let it come upon you. Amen. You invite everyone and those that are listening to us online and those that are going to get this money, please send it to everyone under your influence. They will be blessed in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's give our offering to the Lord. If you are giving your tithe, your offering, or you are supporting what God is doing, please let's do so. If you are doing it online, send it to the account details as you are seeing on the screen. I pray in the mighty name of Jesus that the power of God will rest upon you. Amen. Upon your offering. Amen. There is an offering that carries glory, that attracts glory. There is an offering that will activate glory. May you give such an offering in the name of Jesus. Amen. When Solomon gave an offering to the Lord, an offering that nobody has ever given, that, that, that offering released a new glory, glory that God has never given to anybody. I want to pray for somebody in this glory feast. The grace to give an offering that will make God to release a glory upon you that has never given to anybody. Up to today, the Bible says there is no body like Solomon, even in glory. I pray, let the Lord release that grace and appoint an anointing upon you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Lord, accept our offering. Amen. Thank you, everlasting Father. Thank you, we give you all the glory. Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. 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 In Jesus' Jesus name. name. Said to me the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. The love of God. Amen. The sweet of the Holy Amen. Spirit. Amen. Rise and abide with us. Amen. Now and forevermore. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name. Said to me. Let somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen.